It's always interesting being the only not Fox on on screen. <laughs> I think every like non Fox player has has been there at some point. Everybody else is playing Fox, looking at you weird, saying why why aren't you playing this character? He's He's super good, good yeah. <laughs> you push buttons and do some pretty some pretty amazing things if you push the buttons in the right order. Yeah. Fox is pretty good, I would say. Also, so my shoelaces uh, apparently falling apart. I need uh, the aglet. Also, the aglet. Is, is aglet here? I not even haven't sure. seen him. Aglet, uh, aglet is PR now. Yeah, he made the PR. He's number 20 now. Uh, as you don't know, NBBA just came out with a new power ranking, uh, which it was a uh, what was it called? Like when people vote on it. Uh, it was a committee. Panel? Panel, yeah, panel. panel PR. For the first time in NDBA for quite some time. Uh, yeah, Aglet broke in as number 20. Alright, but they strike to Dreamland, which, yeah, uh, I can definitely see. I feel like Dreamland is not a bad stage for Ice Climbers, which no, it's definitely is not. really, like, really, like, when you're choosing stages here, it's what is good or bad for Ice Climbers. It's right. Really well, you don't want to give him FD. Uh, and Pokemon is probably the next best thing to FD. So I would say, yeah, the neutral stage is probably Dreamland. Because that's the third best stage for Ice Timers. That makes sense. That makes sense. Get a Kobe with the on, on point analysis. Please. <laughs> Alright, so. Put you off stage, but uh. Alright, nice off smash. I'm surprised even. he died there, actually. Why don't we hit on Dreamland? Uh, I'm not. Fox broken. <laughs> <laughs> No, no, no. <laughs> Not in PAL. <laughs> Definitely would have survived in PAL, I think. We've been playing with that 20XX attack back in, like, the PAL box. Yeah. You know, fun. PAL Yoshi definitely would have survived yeah. that against what PAL. Yeah, what the heck? PAL, PAL Yoshi would have like, up, like, four feet. That no, was it. If Achilles is ever watching this, uh, you didn't put PAL Yoshi in the 20XX attack back. What the heck? Like, come on, man. I want to play my better character. <laughs> Ooh, that's my character shot. A really early death. It was like 23%, I think. Yeah. They just didn't have any options. Wow. It was instantly... Yeah, oh, Chillin wow. gets edge guard, and now we're, we're even. We're dead even. even match, yeah. I'm trying to get the team combo on red. Shu getting putting a uh, red off stage, and he can't recover. Is, is Milkman using the top? Right now. I believe he is. A little bit confusing. <laughs> Show off stage again, but... Up air. Oh, I was looking for that combo continuation, but didn't get it. Oh, chill inside bees. Yeah. He gets uh, edge guarded. Chill putting on his hurt. In trouble there, though, but... Chilling off stage. Ooh, he was looking for that shine. Yeah. You didn't get it. You got hit by the fire shield. Yeah. Fox is up B. Uh, of course, it takes a little. It takes like a, a little bit of time. It's like uh, a second. For, yeah, for the hitboxes to come out. Flames. Falco, of course, though, uh, it, like never has a hitbox until he starts going. Yep. <laughs> Both side B. It looks like a blue team. Both of them are really high percent, but uh, they do have a stock lead. Yeah, and it's going to be, despite both of the blue team's players uh, being high percent, it's going to be really tough for uh, Red to come back. Well, that's how you start doing it. Now you got to, oh, if he got like an up smash or something. When yeah, Chu, Chu was just light shielding was, there, yeah. waiting for Chillin to come back. Oh, nice up smash, trying to put a dent into him. Alright, sure, Chillin, I think that's gonna be, be it. Back air. No, oh, nice, alright. So, you think they go Congo? <laughs> Maybe! That was their counter pick of choice in Winter's Finals. Uh, so we'll see. Maybe they'll ban it. <laughs> oh, yeah. The unexpected Congo ban. Yeah, no one ever bans Congo, because, like, they just don't expect you to go there. And then it's like, when you go there, it's like, what People the heck? Are like, wait, that's a legal yeah. stage? Yeah, some. I, uh, uh. I played on a TV uh, at Big House where they didn't even have it unlocked. <laughs> Our teams. So Dude, it's like 15 minute melee, come on, step it up. Yeah, so. That's actually like the hardest thing. So <laughs> if I any of you know, at yeah. home are struggling, you can try being DK and just using down B over and over again. 
<laughs> Alright, here we go. We're on Congo. Alright, yeah. Did you go back to Congo? Uh, Chun Chun, of course, coming from Boozers. Dan is dead. Yeah, wow. I, I really think, uh... That's why they, they picked it, is because, you know... Like, what can uh, the Ice Congress do? Like, how can they recover? Uh, actually, I feel like they have some interesting options. Because you could, like, when you're rising with your side B, you rise a little bit in Sobo. You could potentially get from, like, the into the middle of the stage. Alright, cool. The up smash is both of them. Chillin' just shine stalling. Waiting for the barrel, I think. Oh, oh nice my save. gosh. The barrel does. Wow, and out. really, really smart recovery from Chillin' just yeah. shooting through the stage and then taking the barrel. Freaking all these, as of yet, never before seen Congo specific technology. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this stage is not legal in singles because the platforms are so high that certain characters can just camp out yep. other characters. It's a very infamous match of, uh, I think it was Pink Shinobi versus uh, some Ganondorf player. And, uh. Oh, uh, was that. I was supposed to say it was Eddie. Well, maybe not. I don't think so. No. But, like, he. I think there was, like, one stock exchange in eight minutes. So, it's like. No, the stage banned. <laughs> Cannot happen. But of course, in doubles, you can't really camp in doubles, which is what I, I love doubles. Uh, so hey, you're, you have you have definitely platform camp people. Before. Me? In singles. Wow. You've done it. I have You've not. Done it. Don't lie to me. All right. The one time I did it was against like one of the first Ice Conference players I've ever played. So I was like, what the heck do I do? <laughs> I just go down there and I get grabbed. So just just the grabs. Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, Invisible Ceiling Glitch. I actually don't know what triggers that. I think it involves something about, like, it going a hit going through a player's shield or something. I, I have no idea. It's something that you see every once in a while. You know what does it all the time? And it may just be the hitbox. Roy's counter. <laughs> Roy's counter does it, like, 80% yeah, yeah. of the time. I think I've seen it before. It's so weird. Alright, anyways, Red Team, it looks like the pick is working out. They definitely have a uh, stock lead right now. Shoot, putting in some work. Stock. Trying to get the team combo. Oh, get it. It's really risky by Red, but he makes it back. Really smart move way over the barrel there. Yeah, they definitely have some Congo tech. <laughs> I wonder if they just go to this like often. I'm not, I'm not sure. Yeah, I gotta say, you don't see a lot of you don't see Congo very often. No. In, in recent memory, this is the first time I've seen anyone on the stream go to Congo and shell shock. Mm -hmm. Like in the last like three or four shell shocks. I oh my seen. god, that was a crazy combo. Oh, just barely a break. Yeah, if he got that kill, I would have been insane. Okay, yeah, and this is over. Yep. I'm gonna, gonna see that. <laughs> Almost. Well, you never know with Fox, you know? You, you can... never know. There are three Foxes on the field. Chillin', Chillin going, throwing out those Just going tilts. with the uplifts, man. He does that so much. He just like waits for you to run into it. And it has such a good hitbox. It's it like, is. It's so huge. Yeah. It's like this swath of red if you ever look at the actual like... Oh, good up smash. Good tech. Jeez. It's almost like these are top players or something. <laughs> yeah, definitely everyone is playing. Uh, I think they're definitely in the top 10 in PR. Yeah. Well, so. Chill is doing really well here. Yeah, he's buying uh, himself a lot of time. mistake, though. That little mistake, though. Alright. That synchronized gun. <laughs> Always feels good to get the synchronized after a team win. Yep. <laughs> Alright, then take it FD. Okay, yeah, definitely so Ice Timer is best stage. So. Yep, for sure. And I think Chillin uh, likes the stage as well. I feel like I remember Chillin like picking FE against Fly M and Eda or something like that. Like he just loves the stage like almost too much. It's like DP and True Dance. <laughs> yeah. But anyways, we have uh, it's one one in uh, set one of Grand Finals. Not sure if we'll see a set two, uh, but Red Team definitely looked calm and composed that last game. And they take the first stock. Gets no flash, and there you go. Man is of no help at all. <laughs> she just stands there. Oh, and it, that's gonna oh, be it. Oh wow, really good. Yeah, that was really great tech. 
yeah, red team really capitalizing. Uh, it's gonna be tough for blue team to come back already, especially when like it's really noticeable uh, who has the lead if like if someone loses two stocks before they uh, you know die at all. Yeah, and that was also a cool angle by the red team there, trying to keep each other alive. That was a weird hitbox on up smash, but it was also interesting the eye. Jeez, that falling up air. <laughs> Chilling wow. special. It's so good. It's, it is. It's so good. Like, you have to not get grabbed, but if you don't get grabbed, it's so good. Man's been staying alive a long time, too. <laughs> Yeah, Chu just trying to hold our new stock. Uh, yeah, Red Team is definitely in command right now. Blue Team definitely, uh, this last hill with stocks, they've been doing a lot of work. Oh, but here you go. Uh, Chillin does not die, but... That'll do it for me. Yeah, Dan is dead. Yeah, this is just looking like a strong game for Red Team. Yep. I wonder Shown if they'll go back here. Such high percent to... This is really basically a 1-1. One -one. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> Chilling combo me too a little bit. <laughs> Ooh, good throw. That might oh, be wow. oh. oh, interesting that he went all the way down there. Oh, wow, the Nair. he jumped out of that too. He jumped out yeah. of the shine and got hit. Hmm. Oh, and then Chillin kills himself. Oh, yeah. Man. They were definitely starting to make mount a comeback though. Yep. Alright. Good stuff to Red and Milkman. Uh, but yeah, do you go back? This is like, you know. Different players have different like mindsets with this. Like, if you just got beat on your like there preferred stage, do you go back, or you know, do you go somewhere else? And it looks like Chillin and Chu say no. Uh, I love FD. <laughs> just saying that last match was a fluke. Chu definitely doing some work on a uh, milkman right there. It's really tough to ex to escape uh, you know icy grabs. Nice, uh, nice uh, ledge grab from both man there, just sneaking it. So yeah, I don't know why Chillin opted to go for the ledge there, though. Because, you know, in teams, like I always say, like, you know, you just kind of want to go to the stage. It's easy for one out of two people to just grab the ledge, the ledge. and completely destroy you. Nice team combos. Ooh, Chu's shield is really low. He was light shielding, and then he took a bunch of hits. Oh, and Chu grabs the lights before Chillin' and Chillin's dead. Oh, man. Red team is really off to a, a solid lead. Yep. And oh, another, another shine spike. This is just the back throw. This is looking oh, really no. good for Red team. But then Milkman drops the stock. Up air. That'll do it for Chu. Man, yeah, this is uh, this seven is stocks a to three. It's been pretty rough for yeah. the team. It's going to have to be some Pretty amazing to come back from this. <laughs> what is the fruit that lies before me? I don't know. Anyway. <laughs> oh, and yeah. yeah okay, right, it grabs the edge. And this, yeah, that was. That's gonna that was do it. <laughs> kind of anticlimactic, but. Yeah, that's. Geez, that's over. All the games are really close, and then. Up smash, like, and that's it. Incredible. Grab release and charge up smash is such a pretty looking. Yeah. Alright. Red, give Milkman a little hug. Good stuff with them. Uh, and yeah, they take melee doubles. Yep. Good stuff. Uh, Chun Chillin getting second. Tope and Savage is your third place team. Uh, really surprising, I would say. Um, yeah. I mean, p pretty surprising, considering how stacked this tournament was. Yeah. yeah, there were not a lot of like mid or low level teams. It was like <laughs> you were playing like, you know, your first rounds, and then it was like, bam. Yeah. <laughs> At least it was for me. Yep. So. And like, even like the the highest seeded players, it's just like, all right, I'll I'll win it. I'll win like three matches, and then I'll have to fight some fight someone tough. No, it's you win one match, and then suddenly it's like I'm fighting him. Right. Yeah. 